Now, the need to jettison Godfatherism in Nigerian politics is once again brought to the fore. At the weekend, President Mohamed Buhari, while renewing his membership of the APC, declared that the party will take steps to end imposition of candidate, thereby giving citizens more power to choose their representation. Osaoge Ogbonwan takes a closer look at this statement. The quest for proper leadership in Nigeria has been in constant demand with every electoral cycle. The demand for proper representation at different levels of government cannot be overemphasized as it reflects on the quality of governance and development. Oftentimes, the electorate get to suffer the consequences of poor representation. It begs the question, do the people truly determine the leadership they get? One of the things that democracy does not promise is that you will have that the best candidates will emerge. I mean, it's not one of the promises of democracy. Rather, what democracy promises is that the more popular candidate will emerge. Now, the more popular candidate is not necessarily the best candidate. In the Nigerian party system, internal democracy has been the bane of poor leadership and less than average representation. With the much needed paradigm shift coming from President Muhammad Buhari on Saturday, but skeptics consider the statement just as political rhetorics. Well, the embarrassment that has happened in the past um, one year or two, where candidates have been sacked by the court, is supposed to send a strong signal that the days of imposition are over. But as is usually the case, some people still won't learn their lesson. But it's at, least, it's at least a good thing that the president is looking to make that happen during his, um, what has been part of legacy that he wants to leave for Nigerians. Uh, but when you look at what are those factors that disposes the party to this problem, Part of it has to do with the law itself, the, the party constitution that allows uh, what they call the direct and the indirect method of choosing candidates within the party. So it goes all the way to the constitution of the party, which we need to deal with at the constitutional level. And then um, let's hope that, they, 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 that, that we have enough, the right level of maturity According to political analysts, different levels of representation right from the primaries are important to the democratic ethos, and it is vital that citizens have the absolute power to choose who is given the mantle of leadership. Osaogi Ogboa, Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.